Hi guys, Miso here with Miso Making It. Welcome to my kitchen where today we're making a delicious sweet southern pineapple pudding. Here I already have my saucepan and um, I have a few other ingredients. I use, I'm going to use a half a stick of butter, getting it right into this saucepan. I have one cup of sugar here. This is just regular granulated sugar. Here I have two cups of milk that I'm spilling, but I've got to go ahead and get that two cups down into this saucepan and I'm reserving just a little. Then I'm going to add my egg into it, whisk it so that I'm not introducing an egg into hot liquid. So let me get my whisk and I'm going to just whisk this together and I got it down into my pot. Here I'm putting in some Argo, some cornstarch, it can be any brand. I'm going to use two tablespoons here. In goes my first tablespoon of cornstarch and my liquid is just barely warm. So you wouldn't want to introduce this into hot liquid. So that was two tablespoons, I am whisking it. Now I've got my heat up and I am whisking away. Now you can see that it's, it's boiling, but I'm gonna turn it up just a little bit more so I can get a better boil. In goes a teaspoon of, vanil of uh, lemon flavoring and now a teaspoon of vanilla flavoring. And here I'm going to put in one teaspoon of allspice and then I'm whisking, whisking away. Now you can see that as my pudding is still bubbling and getting thick, I'm gonna go ahead and add vanilla wafers to my glass casserole dish. So I'm just gonna cover the bottom. Here I have pineapple chunks. In fact, I have two cans of dough pineapple chunks, but you can use any kind that you find on sale. I'm gonna just begin to layer my bowl with cookies first and then pineapples and cookies again and pineapples until I fill my bowl. You put in as much cookie or pineapple as you like. I've already turned off my pudding mix because it is very thick. Now I'm gonna take some of these vanilla wafers and I'm gonna just make a wall right around my casserole dish. Just standing the cookies up. Now I'm pouring this hot uh, pudding mixture over my entire casserole dish. So I want to make sure that the pudding mixture is getting all the way down to the bottom because I want every cookie, every pineapple to get some of this goodness. So I'm using this butter knife to just push open some places that the, so that the um, pudding can go all the way to the bottom. Now I can get the rest of my pudding in. Mmm, mmm. Wish you could smell this, guys. Ugh. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and my final layer is going to be cookies and I'm going to put on quite a lot of cookies because me and my crew, we like really more cookie than pineapple in this um, recipe. And so I put my more cookies on the top. So when you're eating it, you're going to have some really soft cookies and some cookies near the top that are not quite as soft. So it's a different kind of um, a feel in your mouth, but it's delicious. You put as much as you like and what your family likes. Okay, that should be about enough. Here, I have my two egg whites that were left over from the egg yolks that I put in the pudding. And I'm just using my hand mix, mix, uh, mixer. And I'm just gonna beat these eggs for about a little over a minute. And you see they're already getting white. They're already getting fluffy. And I'm beating them on very high, my very highest speed of my hand mixer. I just added in two tablespoons of sugar to this meringue mix. And I am beating again. And I, you can see that the meringue is, has a sheen. It is also making uh, peaks. Right now, soft peaks, you beat until you see hard peaks. And we're just about there. And there it goes onto the top of my pudding. You see how stiff this meringue is? Just spread it out, it's ready for the oven. We're going to put it in an oven of 350 uh, degrees. It's already preheated for about 20 minutes. Here's the finished product. This just came out. Oh, what, what about it? Looks good, right? Let's plate it up. Here we have it. This is absolutely the way that I plan it. It is so, it, oh my God, it smells so good. Look at this creamy, thick pudding. 
here you see these these are the crackers the cookies that i put on the top they're not quite as soft as these cookies in the middle but uh let me just taste i gotta do it i can tell you how this tastes let me see cookie pineapple come on my cookie fell off come back here cookie you gotta go with this pineapple mm. oh my goodness delicious delicious guys thank you for watching my videos mm, this is so good try this recipe and if you like my videos guys subscribe and share my videos videos with a friend thank you for watching bye bye